images all too common here in the valley. A car crashing into a home or business is the kind of accident that can happen in an instant. But as ABC 15's Lauren Vargas shows us, the impact can last long after repairs are complete. Pete, have a great weekend. New York transplant Al Viscusi. I'll just split it and skin it. Of Al's meat market in Sun City. We're looking at 2631, Pete. Is happy to be working again. It's just been a long, hard road. Al had a rough summer after a freak accident crashed into his store. I was standing right here when, I, when it all happened. I was putting chicken in the case and. Lady drove right through the front of the store. It was April 29th when an elderly woman lost control and slammed into the deli. Boom, crash, bang. You could, the noise just wouldn't stop. His wife, Trudy, heard it over the phone. Heard a few cuss words. <laughs> You know, he's like, my God, a lady just drove through the front of the store. The car missed Al, but his quick dive out of the way injured his shoulder. I thought there was a bomb going off, truthfully. And when I hit the ground, that's when I tore the rotator cuff. And his bicep was torn. And that was the part that really shook me up, too. And I was like, oh, my God, that's his cutting arm, and what are we going to do? The couple was forced to close their family business for three months. It hurts. It definitely hurts. The Viscusis estimate their losses close to $100,000. We didn't have any money to pay the bills, and the bills just kept coming in and coming in and coming in. But now, thanks to loyal customers... Business is booming! <laughs> they're back in business, digging out of debt, and moving forward with no plans of slowing down. Today was probably our best day since we reopened. In Sun City, Lauren Vargas, ABC 15 News.